So if you don't know who Andrew Tate is, here's a few examples. I'll see you, go get this done. From here, I'll go to Dubai, make some more money. I'm running around the world. I'm doing very, very important things. And if I had a female, if I did, because of course I don't, because I'm a man of God, blah, blah, blah. If I had a female, she would have to be very understanding of the fact that I am a man with a mission with a purpose. And you know, some there are some missions should be allowed to come with me on, and some missions she can't come. It's not safe for females out here. I'm out here. I'm all right. I managed to get here. She's next to me. I got you. I got you. I got you, Leia. You're okay. Uh, but you know, but otherwise, you've got to be careful. No, and the women can't help you, okay, and women cannot help life you. Life's an extreme situation. That but you life's extreme. Is. As a man on the edge, life is extreme, my dear. Life is extreme. Yes, life is extreme. That was no. That was yes. Don't lie to me. It is my job to instill the same warrior spirit in my offspring. I will not have sons who are too busy buying NFTs and saying, oh, I made a little bit of money and have skinny little arms and go to crypto conventions and be dorks. I will not have nerds as children. I refuse to have a nerd carry the late tape. If my son is a nerd, one of us has to die, him or me, and I'll challenge him to mortal combat. Andrew Tate is a British American kickboxer and online personality. Tate had a successful kickboxing career and later gained notoriety online regarding his controversial views, as you can see. And this has gotten him into feuds with other internet personalities such as Twitch streamer XQC, influencer and boxer Jake Paul, and Dave Portnoy, the owner of Barstool Sports. And as many of you know, this is an anime channel, and so I thought it'd be interesting to go over what Andrew Tate has tweeted about his thoughts on anime. If you are over 15 and like cartoons, you are a loser. Anime, Dragon Ball Z, etc., no excuse. Plus, any woman loses respect for you. Grow up. What? Funimation, the massive online anime streaming company, had this to say. These hands are rated E for everyone. <laughs> also, obviously, Andrew Tate in his tweet did state that all women would lose respect for you. And so a few amazing women decided to chime in. Including actress Micah Burton, who is known for being a host on many gaming events and is also an avid cosplayer, as well as LeVar Burton's daughter. She replied with, Flap, I guess I gotta lose all respect for myself then. Because yeah, uh, sorry to tell you Andrew, but turns out, anime is also enjoyed by women. What? what the as shocking as it is to you, millions of women all across the world love anime. Stop the cow. This other very cultured woman replied to Tate saying this, As a female who has an amazing boyfriend who loves anime just as much as I do, this information is truly false and from a jealous biznatch who has no idea what he's talking about. Now excuse me, I have a boyfriend with a new anime show waiting for me on the couch. And as a special treat for him, I have thick thighs and yummy snacks for him to enjoy as well. And as a legendary turn of events, the Giga Chad himself, Gigak, who debatably runs the largest anime channel on YouTube, commented this. Professional man-child tires of bullying the depressed and starts targeting weebs. Good thing we have the power of God and anime on our side. Honestly though, this is obvious bait, but if there's any community that can outbait this baiter, it's the anime community. And the legendary Pizza Crust hater was right because the next day, Andrew Tate tweeted this. Okay, flap it. I give in. Send me pics of the baddest big watermelon anime gardening utensils that exist. Send me the filthiest Picasso ever. I'm an anime fan. I don't know what High School of the Dead clip he saw, but some variation of the 106 really changed his mind. He then tweeted this. All anime guys worship me. I make waifus come to life. And then he proceeded to post a long list of comparison photos between waifus and real life women that he dates. And I will say the images are decently similar to the fan arts, and I cannot show you them without getting banished to the YouTube Shadow Realm. He then had one final anime tweet saying this. I'll spoon all you flapping dorks and have a wholesome Bible study session with all of your waifus. I am anime god. Yeah, okay buddy, calm down. You're like the real life version of Yamcha. But anyway, let me know in the comments what you guys think about Andrew Tate. Do you like him? Do you hate him? Do you think he's anime god, or do you think he's a comparison to the Pokemon Caterpie?